Hi, this is Dr. Koushik Shil, Consultant Brain and Spine Surgeon from RN Tagore Hospital, Kolkata. Today, I will speak about the importance of golden hours in head injury and spinal injury victims. As you know, in patients who suffer from uh, unfortunate events of head and spinal injuries, they are occasionally found lying in the road and they are first attended either by the passerbys or, or by the ambulance uh, or the police staff. And then they are rescued and transferred to the nearest designated hospital. But it is very import important to treat them on spot with some amount of basic first aid like bandaging and also by starting some intravenous fluids and giving them oxygen while on transport. If this is not done, the victim loses blood and also his brain and spinal cord suffers from lack of oxygen. So when he reaches the tertiary care hospital, even after treatment, the full recovery often doesn't occur and the patient remains pa paraplegic, that is paralyzed for a long, long time. This kind of uh, unfortunate events, what we call in medical parlance as morbidity, can be, decre can dec be decreased a lot if we do the primary treatment on site. This can be delivered by any person. Suppose you, fi you find a person lying in the, on the roadside after suffering from accident. What you need to do is to attend the person quickly and do the basic bandaging of the bleeding sites. Then an ambulance needs to be called and the patient needs to be transported not to a far away designated hospital but to the nearest health center or a doctor's clinic or even to a medicine shop where he can be put on an IV line and a fluid can be started. This will go a long way to prevent hypotension that is decrease of blood pressure and therefore the patient's circulation will be maintained. At the same time, uh, we expect an ambulance to come by then and all the way to the journey to the tertiary hospital, patient must be provided with an adequate oxygen support. These three will go a long way to prevent many, many uh, victims from becoming paralyzed for long and therefore will cause a lot of decreased burden both to the families and to the treating hospital. Thank you.